All right, it is time to turn your images. You are happy with them. You got to turn them into Canvas. So what do you do? We need to export them. So we're back in the library module in Lightroom. You're going to go ahead and find the images that you've used and your final image. So here is an image I used for the stem. Here is an image I don't think I used. <laughs> and here is the final image and here is the top. So I'm going to select that one. I'm going to select the stem. So I'm holding down command or if you're on a PC control, and then I'm going to hit the final image over here. So I have all three images selected. Now I need to go ahead and export them. So I need to hit the export button over here on the left hand side. And now I need to make my settings. So when we turn in photos, we need to export them to convert them from raw or TIFF files to JPEGs. And usually you also want to limit the file size. Um, so here we are. We're going to go to export to a specific folder. Um, if you have not made one yet, we're going to make a folder on the desktop called web export. So you're going to go, if this is not already set up like desktop web, desktop web export, you're going to go to choose. Next, you're going to select under your favorites, the desktop, and you are going to create a new folder and call it web export and hit create. Mine's already made. You want to make sure that it is selected. There it is. And you're going to hit don't select any subfolders and then you're going to go ahead and hit choose. Next, you're going to select put it into a subfolder and you're going to call this one stop action composite. Um, next, you can rename it to a custom name so you can do Oops, there we go. Stop action. I would eliminate the space and then do a dash last name dash first name. So that's your last name, your first name. Um, I do custom name sequence. So you just have to check that on and select that. Next, um, we want to make sure we're exporting under file settings to JPEGs and then we want to limit the file size. So just click that on to five thousand kilobytes which is five megabytes um, you don't need to resize it but you could put the resolution as 72 you just pop that in and then since we're going to be viewing these on the screen right now sharpen for screen then you're going to go ahead and hit export once they export you're going to see that little progress bar in the top left side of lightroom you'll also see it down here on the um, bar once they're done exporting, they will appear in the folder on the desktop that you called web export right here. And here they are. And if you hit spacebar on a Mac, you can scroll through. So that's the top image. That's the composite. That's the bottom image. There you go. And then you just insert them into the text box.